Our JVA 4Line keypad is a menu driven keypad, easy to use. As you can see, it's connected to a JVA Z14 energizer. This keypad is compatible with our whole range of JVA energizers. It displays the zone and the unit that's connected. It also displays your company name, time, date, and that the unit is disarmed. I'm going into arming the unit. I'm going to press the arm button and I'm going to enter the pin code one, two, three, four, and hash. As you can see, the keypad is now armed my Z14 energizer. And on the JVA energizer, we can see a return and feed voltage, as well as on the keypad display, which is four lines, you can easily see that zone one with your feed return voltage and that your system is fine. Just to turn the system back off, one would press the disarm button. And your system is now disarmed. To move on to the installation of the keypad, the keypad has got a very robust cover with easy clips on the side which one can clip off and you've got a template which you can either use the white template or the black template. Looking at the keypad itself, it can slide up and you can turn the keypad around and it's got a three pin connector which is your um, positive, negative and data. This connector can easily be removed and your wires wired into your blue pin connector and then placed back onto your keypad. You then turn your keypad around and just easily slide it back in and connect your cover port back onto your keypad. And that's how easy it is to install your JVA 4LINE keypad. Programming this JVA second generation Z series keypad is very easy as it's got a menu driven system by pressing the menu button and typing your pin 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 which is your installer's pin and pressing the hash button it allows you access to the menu driven section where you can set multiple functionality for the keypad. Um, you there's also option here to show your event log as the keypad can store up to 500 event logs. Scrolling down and up on this menu is very easy by using the up and down arrows, two for up and eight for down. Moving back to the main menu, the main function that I would like to show you guys is the actual programming of the device. The keypad will look at the keypad bus and detect all your devices that's connected to this actual keypad. And we can see on ID1, there's a JVA Z14 unit connected. I'm gonna select that unit. It's very easy to change your settings on the keypad once you're in programming. If I would like to change the high power voltage and adjust that, I could press the left arrow which is at 4 to bring my voltage down or I could press the 6 button with the arrow to the right which would then increase my voltage again. To move down I could press 8 again and I could set my low power and increase that voltage as well. Once I'm done with that programming and I'm happy I could press the hash button it would ask save changes to the device yes and it says programming successful and i can return to my main menu go one up and say exit menu and we're back to our home screen again